Some cars, some 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 fins, and some fun. We have a really great event coming up this weekend. Welcome to my guests. Thanks for being here. Tell tell us about the fin, fins and film. Well, this is our eighth year doing fins and films in downtown Spring Valley, Minnesota. We have uh, Friday night is our kids' night where we do a mini pinup and greaser show. We have a DJ. We do a drive-in theater afterwards as well. And then Saturday, starting at eleven, we do a cruise over to Ostrander. We have grass rags over there. We have a car show, an adult pinup show, live music all day, and a burnout pit as well. Oh, it sounds like so much fun. I have to ask, what is a pinup show? Just, Just people dressing up in dresses and things. So think like 50s, 60s, the car hops, the yeah, doo-wop, stuff like that. Super cool. Yeah, okay, I love that. And so we're- You're, like, you're into vintage, so. I love vintage, yeah, you've been paying attention to the show. Mm -hmm. Look at this, what are we looking at here? That's one of the pictures of the burnouts right there. So burnout is like a race with- it, Yep, you're just spinning your tires till the smoke uh, goes. Oh, I love it. And I, we That's just the grass some... drags right there and- Okay, oh, it just sounds so fun. So how did this, this originate? So the founder, a guy named Greg, started doing this he's a classic car guy he started this back in 2017 and it's been slowly building up ever since who doesn't like cla classic cars I mean you see one going down the road and immediately you're like look at this mm -hmm. it's so amazing exactly. and so how did you guys get involved you're just like I've been a board member since last year I became president this year and Emily lives in Spring Valley as well and saw a pinup show and she wanted to dress up, so that's how her and the kids got involved, and here we are. I love it. I love it. I love the hat. I mean, he knows how to put that. You know how to put that on your head and tilt it just right. You guys oh, look great. He's sure charming. I tell you <laughs> what. <laughs> <laughs> that's so fun. So in order to get involved in, like, the pinup thing, how do you do it? We have everything online on our Facebook page. So just literally contact us via face Facebook, and okay. we'll do the rest from there. So look for Fins and Films? Yep, Facebook.com slash Fins and Films. Yep. Oh, okay, okay. And tell me... So for the little kids, go into a little more detail about the, the stuff that the kids can do on Friday. So we have a trailer that we use as a stage, and it's one of those the kids can do whatever we want. Last year I had a good friend of mine, he's got twin boys and a young daughter. The boys went as basketball players. Oh, they were dressed up blue jeans and a white shirt, hair slicked back, look like the old greasers. His two-year-old daughter was up on the stage cheering him on. I love that. So are you going to be dressed up too? I'll be dressed as you see me right now. And I'll you, be busy running around downtown, so. I bet you will, I bet you will. And so the films, tell me a little bit about that. So we do, a, we used to have a drive-in movie theater in Spring Valley. Right, so this is kind of our fun. way of bringing that back. So we set up a stage, we have a projector, a large surround sound system. We play a movie every Friday night uh, during the event. Oh, Usually so at fun. nine o'clock, ever take a little bit with dusk and. Sure, sure, very exciting. Well, th I just am excited about this event because yes, I do love vintage and everybody seems to love vintage cars. So is there anything else I might have missed that you want to let people know about the event? Uh, this year we're adding a new event, 10 o'clock Friday night. We're doing what we're calling a night of fire. Okay. where we're going to have cars that are going to shoot flaming exhaust out of the back end. Oh my gosh, super exciting. Mm -hmm. So if you missed the fireworks on the 4th or the 5th, this is they our were, version come of fireworks. Check this out. Well, you guys, thank you so much for being here. Um, we still have a lot more to come on Midwest Access. We have Nick with the weather, and then we're going to be talking books.